Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Escape from Tarkov quest tutorial. And in this video, we will be discussing the brand new quest from proper, The Bunker Part 1. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are now behind the Black Bishop building. And what we're going to be looking for is this wooden door underneath the, the awning off the back of the building. And we can now enter this little area. And this will take us to the bunker. This is one of the many ways to get down to the bunker. I will take you out another way, but I'm going to take you in this way. But there's there's quite a few ways you can get uh, into the bunker from from the bishop building here and both of the pawn buildings. So once we go through this hole in the wall, right through the next hole in the wall, and then left. And once we get to this area here, we're going to go left all the way down to the end of the hall. Take a right. And another right. Oh, we got some scav action. And then this is where we want to go down here. So once we enter this area, we got to make our way this way. We will encounter some scavs down here, as you can see. I'm just checking this, making sure it's all cleared out. Alright, so once we made it down to the end of this hallway, we're going to turn right into this room here next to the bulletin board. Into this hallway, we got a bunch of rooms here. This uh, looks like the second room on your right. You will see uh, these desks and the projector screen. Oh, there you go. You can get in the first door too. So, first door on your right. And this is the room we're looking for right here. This is the control room. Once we're in this control room, we will have completed the first two uh, tasks um, for, for this quest. To find the underground bunker and locate control room in the underground bunker. This is the control room we are looking for. Uh, we can now survive and extract. And we will have completed this quest. This is a brand new marked room right here. So this requires a key to enter now. There is now three marked rooms in reserve. One more thing about this room, we're going to want to turn on the power. If we go into this back room, we can turn on the power switch right here. And that will light everything up. We can now extract for the D2 exit. And I'll show you where that's at. Alright, we are now underneath the queen building or the dome building. And that's where we will go to extract from the D2 exit. I'm showing you this direction because if we don't have a red rebel yet, like myself, and we are near the dome, we can use this as an extraction if it's open. So if we come, this is the way uh, from the dome, and we come down this hallway, uh, and we come into this cylindrical area here, and we trade over here to the other steps, and then there's a door here. It will be closed. We will enter this door right here. There's another door at the back. It's kind of hard to see. There's another door back here. And then we just follow this back. One more door. And there you have it. That is the exit to D2. It takes a minute. <laughs> So this door has to open and it will uh, allow you to. So the power has to be on as well. And once it's open, you can extract. And there you have it. Okay, I'm going to quickly describe the bunker part two now. And in the bunker part two... Proper asks us to locate the hermetic doors beneath each of these buildings that now connect to this underground bunker. So, um, the underground bunker is located just below me. 
underneath the helicopter and each of the surrounding buildings now connects to that underground area so we have the the white pawn the black pawn the black bishop the white bishop over there and the king building which i used to call queen but is now the white king building so each of these surrounding buildings has now has access to this underground area so what they ask is you need to locate the hermetic doors underneath this area so when we enter this is the white king entrance so when i enter the white king entrance this is the hermetic door they're looking for okay so once you get into this area you will have completed or checked off that part of the quest so if you're wondering what a hermetic door is this is what a hermetic door looks like all right it's this big steel very sealable door almost looks like a submarine door so once you get into this area you'll have checked off that part of the quest and you need to do that for each and every of the surrounding buildings thank you very much for watching i hope this helped you complete bunker part one uh, if you're looking for more content we are live every monday through friday on twitch.tv slash low c live from uh, about 2 to 9 p.m. Eastern Time. So come check us out. Come say hello. Tell me that you came from YouTube. I'd greatly appreciate it. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you want to see more content like this, hit subscribe. And I will see you in the next.